Hey everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another episode of the Xbox 360 Minecraft Survival. I said that the, the complete wrong way around. But anyway, welcome back guys. Um, last time we ended out with this start of a beautiful house. Now, um, lots of you seem to be quite impressed with the design and I must, I must admit, looking back on it, I am really liking it still. So, today what we're going to do is simply just finish this. So, um, we need to work out what I did wrong here. So we went three here. Um, what did I do wrong? I think I messed up this back bit. Let's have a looky here. Um, yes, I think I've messed this up. So if I just, uh, where's my dirt gone? Let me grab my dirt and we can start this back up. Here we go. One, two, three, four. And we can chop this house down. So after we've done this house, um, what we're going to do is go exploring. Because I really want to find a village soon because I've got something really cool planned for when we do find a village. So I want to find them, one of them really soon. And I have been told that there's one nearby. So that could be quite, um, that could be quite awesome. I'm going to grab some of these planks as well so we can continue this. And what I also want to do is make uh, an underneath part to this, obviously, as well. And should I have this completely mirrored or should I have, like, a big open bit? Um, let's have a look. Um, I think I'm just going to put bricks along the bottom. Uh, let's put them there and do this. I, I got way too many bricks, didn't I? <laughs> I actually got loads of bricks. It was crazy. I need to chop this down because this looks and is out of place. So let's chop this down, go all the way across here. And that looks cool. Nice. Right. What We need to decide what we're doing now with uh, this pit. So we need to decide. This is the front. And now we need to decide what to do with the back. I'm not really sure, to be honest. I might have like a little balcony bit because... Not a little balcony, but a little back door bit so that we've got kind of like a bit that goes out to a little garden, maybe. Let's see what steps we've got left. Let's just make it uh, like this, maybe. And then we can have some fence across the sides. I'm just I'm just uh, going ahead with this and doing it just because I, I think it might be a good idea. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to look good at all. Um, I'm just kind of playing it by ear now as what stuff looks like rather than having a plan. So if we have two doors here as well, uh, it should look okay. And then we can have, yeah, let's just, let's just do the same same kind of design. Let's not have the same window though, because then it will look completely identical, but at least we'll have, ah, oh, I ran out, of, no, ah, ah. I knew that would happen, but um, we'd run out of, we've run out of logs, good damn it. So yeah, let's not have the same window design. We could just make, let's have a look here. Um, I don't know. We could just have it the same on each side and it could look quite nice still, but I don't know if I want that. It's kind of boring, but we're not going to spend too much time in the house, I guess. We're going to be spending a lot of time out of it. So let's grab some doors. We can still hear the pigs having a, having a bath. We do need to go and sort out some food and stuff, so we'll go and do that as well in this episode, of course. Sorting out um, all the breeding and stuff like that. Uh, I don't know how much wheat I've got left, actually. I didn't have a look. I also need to finish the sides of this. And stuff like that. So here we go. Uh, one door, two door. And that is the back door. We also need uh, some more cobblestone. And so we need more cobblestone and more planks. So just for the, the, the start of this part, what we're going to do is just uh, get some wheat. Oh, here's some wheat. And sort out these animals. Slay what we need to be slain. And just get all aggressive up in this barn right now. Let's have a look here. How's it going, animals? How you doing, guys? Uh, we still need to get some chickens, actually. So let's... Oh, God, they're all coming after me. Uh, let's select two of these. Two of these. There we go. Now we need two sheep to mate. Two of these sheep to mate. Uh, two of these and two of these bad boys. There we go. And now we can slay some. I feel really bad for doing it because I just do. So let's, let's choose this guy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, you only gave me, like, two pork chops. What's wrong with you? I need to somehow get in without anything escaping. Grab the pork chop and get out. There we go. That worked quite nicely. We only got two pork chops from that, which is a bit upsetting. But, um, sorry, cow. Sorry. And we got, uh, two beef from him. So that's not too bad. Uh, we need to snip all of these up as well. So let's go ahead and do that. Stay in. Stay in. Uh, snip. Uh, snip, 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 snip. Come on, let's snip this up. There we go. Uh, how much? Oh, what escaped? Snip. <laughs> what escaped the snipping? 
So there we go, we've got lots of animals in here, lots of very loud animals. And we can go ahead and um, cook some stuff now. I'm sorry. Oh wait, I was just about to slay that pig and it just teleported. Wow, that's interesting. So, let's cook uh, this pork and uh, this beef here. So we've got some foods. Got another piece of glass randomly in there. What else have we got? Uh, we've, oh, we've already got some steaks anyway. So we're slowly building up a little, um, a little collection of food. Which is the whole idea of having a barn in the first place. Right then, we kind of need to go and get some more logs and stuff. But what can we do in the meantime? Let's just use the cobblestone we've got to make... Uh, to make some some stairs and some wood stairs as well. There we go, we made 20. So we should be able to line out the rest of this the side bits. Maybe not the top bit, but at least we'll be able to do the side. So let's do this, 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 this. All right then. This should be all the way across here like that. And then we can start mining up as well. Actually, we need to do the across part of this too. I need to chop this one down because this one's going to be an edge part as well. And yeah, next episode will probably involve a lot more exploring because if I don't finish the house in this episode, I will be um, finishing it off camera and then showcasing it in the next episode. Because um, I want to get some exploring down so that we've got a little less building. We've had a lot of buildings so far and I want a little bit less. I'm just going to say that so far. Um, but... That doesn't mean we're not going to be building anything. We still have building, but I want to... I need some villagers for my next build. I've got one in mind um, at the minute, but I need some villagers to do it. Which sounds pretty confusing, and it probably is right now. But uh, we need some villagers for it. We need some villagers for our little plan. So what am I doing now? I need to kind of finish up the roof design, I guess. Uh... This is going to take a lot of wood to go across, isn't it? Wow. So when um, we get to about third way through the episode, I'll uh, cut it and go and get loads of wood. Because we do need a lot of it. A lot of it. So let me just start it while we've got some time. And while we've got some wood on us. Actually, let me see how many planks I've got. And I might just do it anyway. Let's have a look. Oh, we've got loads of planks. So let's go and do that now. I haven't changed my skin again. I was supposed to change my skin, but I didn't do it. That's okay, we'll save that for next time. Uh, I won't change my skin every episode, but I'll change it um, every now and then. Let's just make all of these planks into stairs. 51 should do it. If that doesn't do it, I'll be pretty surprised, actually, for that many, that, that much uh, stairs. Get out of here. Get out of here. There we go. Give me this scaffolding back. Oh, it's turning to night. Of course it is. Don't do this to me. Where's the sun? Where's the sun? It's going in. Ah, oh, why, why, why? Let's just carry on anyway. We should be safe on the roof, I guess. I'll say that, but then a creeper will spawn and then we'll all perish. <laughs> that'll be just, that'll be nasty. That'll be absolutely nasty. But we know creepers are nasty creatures. Actually, um, yeah, this isn't going to be enough wood at all, I don't think. That's the wrong one. Catch it. So we caught it. That's fine. Let's make it all the way across here, just like this. And we should just make a, a nice standard roof at the end because it will match up uh, at the top, which is usually a concern of when you're building um, when you're building roofs is whether it's going to match up. And that's something I've accidentally achieved this time. I usually forget to check if it's going to match up. And then when I get to it, surprise, it doesn't match up. But this time we actually have got that going. Actually, I don't need these ones on the end, do I? Because these are going to be these are going to be stone stairs. So we can save a little bit there, but they're going to fall on the floor. Um, I should probably, yeah, I should probably sleep right now because there's going to be nasty spawning everywhere. Let's get inside, save ourselves, and um, yeah, we don't want anything bad happening right now. Let's get inside and have a nice nap. Beautiful. So what I'm going to do now is when we wake up, which will be any second now, I'm going to go and get a load of wood and a load of cobblestone as well. So we can finish up this house um, easily in this episode, sort out moving some stuff across, sort out our new bed, cool stuff like that. So I'll see you in a bit, guys. Bleh. Right then, so I am back with um, a lot of stuff. I have got um, a stack and a bit of logs and I've got two stacks of cobblestone I think so that should be enough to finish this house. Well I hope so anyway. Oh get a fella did. Um, I started to mine around um, the caves kind of over there. I didn't go in the caves because I want to save that for like a certain episode but um, 
there's some interesting stuff down there. Um, I, I almost got killed by a skeleton. Well, he kind of threatened me. He didn't actually touch me, but uh, yeah, it got a bit aggressive up in there. So let's finish this up then, shall we? We need some planks. I've got no room, no room whatsoever. Uh, let's have a look here. We've got some planks, some slabs. I need to get rid of some dirt. The wool can go. We're getting a nice collection of wool now. Uh, I got another chest. I just mined up the bonus chest that was around. Uh, I need some of that. Some glass, some birch wood planks, some actual birch wood. And uh, we've got, yeah, let's make all of these 28 planks into, uh, yeah, let me just make 28. Or let's just make uh, two stacks of planks and then make a load into stairs. I'm not sure how many we're going to need, so let's make a stack of stairs and then we need some cobblestone stairs as well but we don't need as many of those so let's try this we have 20 of each so let's try it let's see what happens uh, those those cows and stuff having a bath are so loud ridiculously loud let's uh let's do this shall we let's do this let's finish this up real nice and then hopefully we can start uh, moving our stuff along. Well, just moving it so that we can have our bed at least in there and have at least one sleep in our brand new house. Because I would enjoy that. I would enjoy that thoroughly. Let's see how many uh, stairs we're going to need. It doesn't start off great by <laughs> by doing that. Where's... Oh, my axe died, didn't it? Oh, God damn it. Oh, well. Wood is fine. It's not too slow. But let's just be a, a bit more careful with our placing here. If we just put this all the way across... We should make a, a nice, nice roof. There we go. And um, as you can see here, this is what I meant by it going perfectly to a point. And it should look very, very, very nice. I'm quite impressed, actually. I didn't think I'd ever be able to make a house this kind of good in survival. And I've, I've impressed myself. I'm not going to lie. I have impressed myself. And there we go. It's actually got quite a high roof, to be honest. Uh, I didn't think the roof would be that high, but it's all good. That's fine. High roofs are good. Because that means we've got more space to fit in, maybe like a chandelier or a, um, I don't know, something really nice. I thought I really wanted to get the top part of the uh, the bit slabbed off so that we could put our bed next to the roof, um, next to the glass, sorry. But it doesn't look like we're going to be able to do that, unfortunately, because of the slab rules in this version of Minecraft. But we'll, we'll find a workaround when it's done. It might be okay to have like a spiral staircase so that we can have a bed up there somewhere kind of like a bunk bed without a bottom bunk if you know what I mean sounds kind of strange but hopefully you understand uh, we need to put wooden stairs up here and I'm running out I'm running out already three two one we've got like a perfect amount to go up here but we need I guess like half a stack to finish that off but uh, that, that's fine we'll just finish this off before we go back and make some more and how are we doing for time? We're about halfway through the episode now, maybe uh, even less. And yeah, we just need to finish up this bit of stone stairs and then the rest of the roof is done. And then we can sort out the back door and then the house is complete, which is awesome. And we should be doing it nice and on time because that means we can go ahead and, and do the inside for the rest of the episode. And then we're done. We're done with our fantastically looking house. I'm liking it. Look at that. Yes. Yes, impressed with my with myself, my own skills. Is that bad? Uh, I don't know, but I'm impressed. I am looking forward to moving in. Moving in day is going to be awesome. Let's just craft a few more wooden stairs. Let's go for 32. And it should be okay, I think, to make that many. Ah, oh, yes, I'm excited. <laughs> this is going to be so cool to move in and actually uh, pull all our stuff across. We don't actually have too much stuff. But I kind of want to make that room underneath as well. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that now because it's just going to take longer. And I really want to start getting the uh, villager plan in action as well. Uh, I'm not sure how well that's going to work. But it will need some time after we've found a villager because we need to get them to move in over here. Which is going to be difficult, but I think it might work. Let's just uh, do it this way. Have I got enough? Have I got enough to finish it off? No! <laughs> not if I waste them like that. I think I've got three left. Uh, four, one, two, three. Yes! It's complete, guys. It's complete. I would like to have a chimney in the future, but for now, it's all good. It's all good. It's looking... Ah, it's going to be the perfect house for us. I need to light up the inside a bit more, otherwise it's just going to turn into a mob spawner. 
Oh, I said it was complete, but I haven't even done this side. What a noob. What a noob. Let's uh, put this wood up here. I kind of need to decide just what I'm doing with this side. Uh, let's get that, rid of that glass. I could just put uh, glass all along here and then wood all along the other side. Let's just try that, shall we? Because we can get this wood back anyway. Here we go. Will that let in enough light? I'm not sure because it's going to be kind of uh, concaved, but let's try it anyway. Just need some more planks up in my grill. Here we go. And uh, we just need glass panes along there. It might be a bit dark, but who cares? We finished it. <laughs> we have finished it. Let's put some torches here. Torches in. I might do like a glowstone chandelier from the top, but we can do that later on. Also need some pressure plates for in here. And oh, we got some glass panes already, so we can do that. But I might need some more. Yeah, let's go make some more quick. And then we can decide what we want to do with the old house. I'm not really sure what I want to do with it. I was thinking blow it up, but it's very close to our um, to our barn. And then I was thinking, oh, maybe I could set it on fire instead. And, and then it's still very close to the barn. So I do not want to damage it just yet because we've only just kind of built it. Um, this is going to look a bit weird. I'm going to need some more planks across here, aren't I? Will it look weird if we put like... Uh, stairs under like that and then put glass panes in no that might look quite nice actually let's put these all across here and yeah that looks fine uh, I don't know if we want to do it in that color though what, what should we do should we do um, this or shall we do uh, we could do birch wood ones they might like look quite nice or does that look quite nice anyway uh, upside down stairs like this yeah I think that looks quite cool Right, let's make a crafting table in here just because it's going to be annoying to just keep going other places. And what was I making? I was making some stairs. So let's make all of this into two stacks. And then I need some more stairs. Yeah, yeah. this is going to look awesome. Here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, boom, boom. And this, this, this. Very nice, very nice. And then we can have the other side as well. Oh, God, that was awful. That was awful placement. Did you see that? Oh, wow. I don't know how I managed that. Just going too speedy for my own good. And then we should have our fantastic, magical house all complete when I put these final... Oh, what am I doing? Oh, I think I want to move that in a different place anyway. Uh, we just need to put these over here. And then we've got a really nice view of the nether island, which will look quite nice uh, when it's all lit up and stuff. And here we go. Guys, we've got our we've got our, our house. Uh, oh, God. No, we haven't. No, we haven't. False alarm. Let's just mimic this around here. Boom. And I need some more sand. Great. I also need some pressure plates just for the inside because I hate kind of turning around to, uh, to uh, turn up my door. What? What? I can hear a zombie. Zombie? Zombie? Why are, you, why are you doing, zombie? Okay, he's just ignoring us. I don't know where the zombie's gone. That's fine, though. We don't want to converse with zombies, really. Let's chop all this, this sand down. And just get ourselves some more glass panes. And then, I keep saying, oh, our house is finished. And then I realize that there's a wall missing. But what is... Where are you coming from, zombie? What is your problem? No, he's really close. What the hell? He must be under the ground, surely. He can't be near us. That's just freaky. That is just freaky. I think I'm just going to mimic each side. Just so that we've got a lot of light coming into the house. I'm just going to mimic each side of the house. Uh, if we smelt this up, we should be good to go. Oh, we got some pork chops. Beautiful. Uh, oh, we got some glass already. We just need a little bit more to make some... What's it called? You know what I'm, you know what I'm talking about. I've uh, got some steaks. I'm going to need some of them steaks up in my... Oh, no. I didn't mean to do that. My spider head is revealed. <laughs> Alright, there's numb on this. And then the house. The house is complete. Oh, God. And then we can um, then we can go ahead and... What, what should we do next? 
What should we do next? I don't really want to go and find the village or find a village in um, this episode because that's what we're going to do next episode. So what we could do is go into a new cave just to end this out. Actually, we need to move. It's moving day. What's wrong with me? We need to actually move this place. So I'm going to wait for this glass to smelt and we should be good to go. Actually, I should be able to just grab it and make some pains already. I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough, but it's worth a try. Here we go. And those can smelt while we're... Uh, sorting the rest out and yes our nice little townhouse is looking very very pretty indeed I forgot to get some pressure plates, but we can make some and here we go. Let's plop this in here Ugh. And then how do we do it on this side? We just kind of filled this in Okay, we're nice and symmetrical. I've got to think about things being symmetrical So that's how that's how it's gonna be I'm afraid it might look I don't know it might look alright actually because we're getting a lot of light into the house uh, which we don't have otherwise I might need to kind of fix up the top bit, but that's fine. We can do that And then the house is complete and we can get on with the rest of the TD Empire and the rest of our beautiful adventures as well I'm probably gonna be just short of this. I need eight more. Yeah, I'm gonna be re Oh wait Yeah, I'm gonna be one short. That is that is just mean that is just really mean We've got one more and that is almost the final slot. If I put the pressure plates... No, let's make this glass bit the final, final piece of the house. And then we can start moving all of our stuff across. You can stop smelting that now. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm excited. Uh, pressure plates. Let's make some of those as well. Where would those be? Uh, yeah, here we go. So I need... Four. And here we go. The last piece of glass is about to go in to our house. And I'm really liking it. Here we go. You ready? You ready? Three, two, one. Bam! The house is complete. Let's put these pressure plates down as well. And then we can start decorating the outside. I actually think we should put some bushes outside because that could look quite nice. Uh, there we go. Does that work? Yes. Here we go. Fully functioning house. Yes. So what I need to do now is I had a chest in here somewhere. Where did I put it? Did I put it away? Why would I do that? But yeah, what I want to do is grab some bushes just to put outside, just to make it look a bit cooler. And we also need a little bit more of this stone stair decoration as well um, on the outside. So let's just put uh, that like that, and that could look quite nice. There we go. And then we can put some bushes around the edge as well. So I'm going to do that right now. Let's go and do that, because the bushes are just nice decorations. And do we have, like, flower pots in this? Let's have a look. Uh, no, I don't think we do. Actually, I might need to go into the crafting table to have a look, but we'll do that in a second. Just grab some of these leaves with our shears. Am I doing that right? Am I doing that right? Yeah, I am. Uh, I think so, yeah. Right, auto save again. God damn it. I, I always forget to turn it off. I think I'm just going to leave it on because if I forget to save it, I'm going to kill myself if something bad happens. Uh, like if it corrupts. I don't know how stable worlds get in um, Xbox 360 Minecraft, but... If PC is anything to go by, I guess we're not using mods and stuff, so it should be okay. But I'm going to keep it on for now. And it gives me a chance to just kind of talk out our plans and stuff like that. Let's make this tree fully naked. Just like this. Oh, yeah. Get out of here, leaves. Get out of here. It doesn't actually use too much durability on the shears either, to be honest. Uh, last one. Bam. And this tree is now just such a, just a pole. It's just a pole. Uh, these are different leaves, it looks like. So let's just get rid of this flower. What leaves do we want to use? We've got oak leaves or we've got birch leaves from the same tree. They might have been left over from before. But I think we're going to go for oak leaves for now. Uh, if we put, like, one there, one there, one there, and one there, do we want to make them any higher? Let's put uh, maybe one there and one round like that. That looks pretty nice, I must admit. That looks pretty nice. I'm going to do that on all sides. And then we can sort it out at the back as well. I could have bushes all the way along here. Does that look cool? I don't really know. Is that too much bushes? Too much? I don't know. Let's try it. And then see what it looks like. We also need to put um, some torches on the outside here. Let's keep the nasties away. Let's put a couple on here as well. I think this like outside balcony bit actually looks quite cool. Here we go, and we'll put that, that, uh, that, and that, and then build this all the way across. No, no, no. This is just one of those things that are really bad to misplace. And here we go. Let's have a look at it. It might look quite majestic at night, and we've got this fountain out here as well. 
I quite like the bushes on the side, actually. Could we make them... I don't think we need them one higher anywhere, do we? Let's have a look. Where's the middle at? This is the middle. So if we do that, that looks cool. That looks cool. I'm doing that on the other side as well. And then I'm leaving the bushes because otherwise there'll be too many. There'll be way too many. There we go. Nice. All right. Next day is moving day. And we're going to move all of our stuff out of this tiny, crappy little shack and into the new townhouse, which I am really pleased with. Uh, it's not going to turn tonight, so we won't be able to sleep in it. But look at this. We actually built this. Oh my god, I feel so accomplished. I feel really, really accomplished. Let's decide where stuff is going to go. So I want, I did want kind of like a, um, actually, does this require more bushes? Does this require more bushes? Uh, yeah, I think that requires more bushes. So what I wanted to do was, where should I have my bed now? Because I, I kind of wanted it up there, but I need to work out if I can, we can't have the planks uh, and the slabs up there, but that's going to be too low for a floor. So what I could do, I guess, is have like a a bit up here. Let's have a look. Um, if I do um, these planks like this, is that going to be too low? And then just have a little bit that goes up, and then we have the bed up there. Is that going to be too strange? Let's have a look here. Get out of here. I need my axe. I need my chop chop egg axe. Uh, boom. Give me that. Uh, will that be too weird? Just to have, like, stairs going down as well? There's only one way to find out. And that is by doing it. So, let's put these there. Uh, just so I can put some here. And then some here. Will that look weird? I can kind of have the under bit, so we can have, like, crafting. I guess it's too near the window. I'm not really sure. But if we had our beds just up there, it could look kind of cool. Eh. Oh my god, the, the decisions, the decisions. Let's make this into... It's going to take quite a bit of time to uh, get right, I think. But if we make that like, like this. And then we have the stairs coming down like this. That could look okay. It means we don't have like a, an upper floor. But, oh, we've got another stairs here. But we do have like a little a bed area and also somewhere underneath where we can have um, just other things like crafting tables and furnaces. I think that I think I might do that. Yeah, that looks cool. So I have the bed here, uh, maybe a little bit of a fence. Uh, I don't think I got. Oh, I got some fences here. Let's have a look. A little bit of a fence there, just to just to round it off. It might it might not work because we've got. Um, What's it called? Because you might spawn outside, but there's only one way to test it. Come here, beds. This is moving day. This is official. This is official business. And if we just go into here and then put the bed up here. There we go. That looks kind of cool. I like that. It's kind of like old school at the same time as being awesome. So we've got kind of like a bunk bed up there. A little place down here where we can put our furnaces and stuff. So let's go and grab those. Because we do have two furnaces. I want to move the, the crafting table into the middle, and then we'll move all of our stuff across. And for now, I'll just have all of the, the chests under here. Just because I don't want to make the basement just yet. That can be for a future episode. We've done a lot of building so far. So we're going to shake it up a little bit next episode and go on a really cool um, expedition to find a village. I don't know if there's any nearby. I have been told that there are some nearby. But it's whether you guys... Are you guys telling the truth? Uh, I, I trust you guys. I trust you guys. Um, so we're going to go and find it. You have told me the coordinates, but I think we're just going to go and um, find it regardless. I don't want to kind of um, just go straight to it. I want to I want to have a little bit of an exploration next time. So there we go. There's those. We need to go and grab our chests now. And then we need to decide what to do with this little shed. I'm not really sure what to do with it, to be honest. We've got two more crafting tables as well. Uh, did I put the other chest down or did I just store it away? Why would I store it away? That's so weird. We are going to need to sort stuff out, though, because things are getting... Um, how do we make an item frame? Let's have a look. I think it's leather and sticks, isn't it? Uh, here we go. Yeah, leather and sticks. I have some leather somewhere so we can put uh, the stuff on the side. I don't know if I... I might put... This is kind of weird, but I might put the chests under here. So that they're in the floor, so they're not too protruding. Uh, there we go. That might look quite cool. Right, what should we put in here? Just building stuff for now. 
Actually, I'm just going to put everything in here just so that I can move everything across in this episode. And by next episode, I'll have everything figured out. There we go. Yes. Yes, I'm feeling awesome. So, thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll outro it while we're, um, we're getting all our stuff together. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. This has been a really successful episode, actually. I did not think we would have this going down today I did but we've done it we've done it and um, I'll take you for a tour of what I've done with the inside next episode because I don't want to do any more building for now and this is what I meant by the chests I think that looks okay we can have the item frames here just for now we could change it later on I could change it before next episode but anyway thank you so much for watching guys moving day has been a amazing experience uh, with you guys also involved in it um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching guys. If this happens to be the first video that you've seen by me, then please do subscribe for daily Minecraft videos on both PC and Xbox. And also, if you did enjoy this video and moving day and do like the build of the house, then please do leave a like and also your suggestions for what to add to the TD Empire next. We've got our barn, we've got our fountain, and now we've got a really nice house. I think the house kind of outshines the barn. I need to fix the barn's roof a little bit, but we'll get to that later. So yeah, thanks again for watching guys, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye! everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another episode of the Xbox 360 Minecraft Survival. I said that th the complete wrong way around, but anyway, welcome back guys. Um, last time we ended out with this start of a beautiful house. Now, um, a lot of you seem to be quite impressed with the design and I must, I must admit, looking back on it, I am really liking it still. So, today what we're going to do is simply just finish this. So, um, we need to work out what I did wrong here. So we went three here. Um, what did I do wrong? I think I messed up this back bit. Let's have a looky here. Um, yes, I think I've messed this up. So if I just... Uh, where's my dirt gone? Let me grab my dirt and we can start this back up. Here we go. One, two, three, four. And we can chop this house down. So, after we've done this house, um, what we're going to do is go exploring. Because I really want to find a village soon. Because I've got something really cool planned for when we do find a village. So, I want to find them, one of them really soon. And I have been told that there's one nearby. So, that could be quite, um, that could be quite awesome. I'm going to grab some of these planks as well so we can continue this. And what I also want to do is make uh, an underneath part to this, obviously, as well. And should I have this completely mirrored or should I have, like, a big open bit? Um, let's have a look. Um, I think I'm just going to put bricks along the bottom. Uh, let's put them there and do this. I, I got way too many bricks, didn't I? <laughs> I actually got loads of bricks. It was crazy. I need to chop this down because this looks and is out of place. So let's chop this down, go all the way across here. And that looks cool. Nice. Right. What We need to decide what we're doing now with uh, this pit. So we need to decide. This is the front. And now we need to decide what to do with the back. I'm not really sure, to be honest. I might have like a little balcony bit because... Not a little balcony, but a little back door bit so that we've got kind of like a bit that goes out to a little garden, maybe. Let's see what steps we've got left. Let's just make it uh, like this, maybe. And then we can have some fence across the sides. I'm just I'm just uh, going ahead with this and doing it just because I, I think it might be a good idea. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to look good at all. Um, I'm just kind of playing it by ear now as what stuff looks like rather than having a plan. So if we have two doors here as well, uh, it should look okay. And then we can have... Yeah, let's just, let's just do the same same kind of design. Let's not have the same window, though, because then it will look completely identical. But at least we'll have... Ah, oh, I ran out of... No! Ah! Ah! I knew that would happen. But um, we'd run out of... We've run out of logs. God damn it. So, yeah, let's not have the same window design. We could just make... Let's have a look here. Um, I don't know. 
We could just have it the same on each side and it could look quite nice still. But I don't know if I want that. It's kind of boring, but we're not going to spend too much time in the house, I guess. We're going to be spending a lot of time out of it. So let's grab some doors. We can still hear the pigs having a, having a bath. We do need to go and sort out some food and stuff. So we'll go and do that as well in this episode, of course. Sorting out um, all the breeding and stuff like that. Uh, I don't know how much wheat I've got left, actually. I didn't have a look. We also need to finish the sides of this. And stuff like that. So here we go. Uh, one door, two door. And that is the back door. We also need uh, some more cobblestone. And so we need more cobblestone and more planks. So just for the, the, the start of this part, what we're going to do is just uh, get some wheat. Oh, here's some wheat. And sort out these animals. Slay what we need to be slain. And just get all aggressive up in this barn right now. Let's have a look here. How's it going, animals? How you doing, guys? Uh, we still need to get some chickens, actually. So let's... Oh, God, they're all coming after me. Uh, let's select two of these. Two of these. There we go. Now we need two sheep to mate. Two of these sheep to mate. Uh, two of these and two of these bad boys. There we go. And now we can slay some. I feel really bad for doing it because I just do. So let's, let's choose this guy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, you only gave me, like, two pork chops. What's wrong with you? I need to somehow get in without anything escaping. Grab the pork chop and get out. There we go. That worked quite nicely. We only got two pork chops from that, which is a bit upsetting. But, um, sorry, Cal. Sorry. And um, we got, uh, two beef from him. So that's not too bad. Uh, we need to snip all of these up as well. So let's go ahead and do that. Stay in. Stay in. Uh, snip. Uh, snip, 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 snip. Come on, let's snip this up. There we go. Uh, how much? Oh, one escaped. Snip. <laughs> one escaped the snipping. So there we go. We've got lots of animals in here. Lots of very loud animals. And we can go ahead and um, cook some stuff now. I'm sorry. Oh, wait. I was just about to slay that pig and it just teleported. Wow. That's interesting. So, let's cook uh, this pork and uh, this beef here. So we've got some foods. Got another piece of glass randomly in there. What else have we got? Uh, we've, oh, we've already got some steaks anyway. So we're slowly building up a little, um, a little collection of food. Which is the whole idea of having a barn in the first place. Right then, we kind of need to go and get some more logs and stuff. But what can we do in the meantime? Let's just use the cobblestone we've got to make... Uh, to make some some stairs and some wood stairs as well. There we go, we made 20. So we should be able to line out the rest of this the side bits. Maybe not the top bit, but at least we'll be able to do the side. So let's do this, 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 this. All right then, this should be all the way across here like that. And then we can start mining up as well. Actually, we need to do the across part of this too. I need to chop this one down because this one's going to be an edge part as well. And yeah, next episode will probably involve a lot more exploring because if I don't finish the house in this episode, I will be um, finishing it off camera and then showcasing it in the next episode. Because um, I want to get some exploring down so that we've got a little less building. We've had a lot of buildings so far and I want a little bit less. I'm just going to say that so far. Um, but... That doesn't mean we're not going to be building anything. We still have building, but I want to... I need some villagers for my next build. I've got one in mind um, at the minute, but I need some villagers to do it. Which sounds pretty confusing, and it probably is right now. But uh, we need some villagers for it. We need some villagers for our little plan. So what am I doing now? I need to kind of finish up the roof design, I guess. Uh... This is going to take a lot of wood to go across, isn't it? Wow. So when um, we get to about third way through the episode, I'll uh, cut it and go and get loads of wood. Because we do need a lot of it. A lot of it. Let me just start it while we've got some time. And while we've got some wood on us. Actually, let me see how many planks I've got. And I might just do it anyway. Let's have a look. Oh, we've got loads of planks. So let's go and do that now. I haven't changed my skin again. I was supposed to change my skin, but I didn't do it. That's okay, we'll save that for next time. Uh, I won't change my skin every episode, but I'll change it um, every now and then. Let's just make all of these planks into stairs. 51 should do it. If that doesn't do it, I'll be pretty surprised, actually, for that many, that, that much uh, stairs. Get out of here. Get out of here. There we go. Give me this scaffolding back. Oh, it's turning to night. Of course it is. 
don't do this to me. Where's the sun? Where's the sun? It's going in. Ah, why, why, why? Let's just carry on anyway. We should be safe on the roof, I guess. I'll say that, but then a creeper will spawn and then we'll all perish. <laughs> that'd be just, that'd be nasty. That'd be absolutely nasty. But we know creepers are nasty creatures. Actually, um, yeah, this isn't going to be enough wood at all, I don't think. That's the wrong one. Chop, 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 chop. Catch it! So we caught it. That's fine. Let's make it all the way across here, just like this. And we should just make a, a nice standard roof at the end because it will match up uh, at the top, which is usually a concern of when you're building um, when you're building roofs is whether it's going to match up. And that's something I've accidentally achieved this time. I usually forget to check if it's going to match up. And then when I get to it, surprise, it doesn't match up. But this time we actually have got that going. Actually, I don't need these ones on the end, do I? Because these are going to be these are going to be stone stairs. So we can save a little bit there, but they're going to fall on the floor. Um, I should probably, yeah, I should probably sleep right now because there's going to be nasty spawning everywhere. Let's get inside, save ourselves, and um, yeah, we don't want anything bad happening right now. Let's get inside and have a nice nap. Beautiful. So what I'm going to do now is when we wake up, which will be any second now, I'm going to go and get a load of wood and a load of cobblestone as well. So we can finish up this house um, easily in this episode. Sort out moving some stuff across, sort out our new bed, cool stuff like that. So I'll see you in a bit, guys. Bleh. Right then, so I am back with um, a lot of stuff. I have got um, a stack and a bit of logs and I've got two stacks of cobblestone I think so that should be enough to finish this house. Well I hope so anyway. Oh god I fell in it. Um, I started to mine around um, the caves kind of over there. I didn't go in the caves because I want to save that for like a certain episode but um there's some interesting stuff down there. Um, I, I almost got killed by a skeleton. Well, he kind of threatened me. He didn't actually touch me, but uh, yeah, it got a bit aggressive up in there. So let's finish this up then, shall we? We need some planks. I've got no room, no room whatsoever. Uh, let's have a look here. We've got some planks, some slabs. I need to get rid of some dirt. The wool can go. We're getting a nice collection of wool now. Uh, I got another chest. I just mined up the bonus chest that was around. Uh, I need some of that. Some glass, some birch wood planks, some actual birch wood. And we've got, yeah, let's make all of these 28 planks into, uh, yeah, let me just make 28. Or let's just make uh, two stacks of planks and then make a load into stairs. I'm not sure how many we're going to need. So let's make a stack of stairs and then we need some cobblestone stairs as well. But we don't need as many of those. So let's try this. We have 20 of each, so let's try it. Let's see what happens. Uh, those those cows and stuff having a bath are so loud, ridiculously loud. Let's uh, let's do this, shall we? Let's do this. Let's finish this up real nice, and then hopefully we can start uh, moving our stuff along. Well, just moving it so that we can have our bed at least in there and have at least one sleep in our brand new house. Because I would enjoy that. I'd enjoy that thoroughly. Let's see how many uh, stairs we're going to need. It doesn't start off great by by doing that. Where's... Oh, my axe died, didn't it? Oh, God damn it! Oh, well. Wood is fine. It's not too slow. But let's just be a, a bit more careful with our placing here. If we just put this all the way across, we should make a, a nice, nice roof. There we go. And um, as you can see here, this is what I meant by it going perfectly to a point. And it should look very, very, very nice. I'm quite impressed, actually. I didn't think I'd ever be able to make a house this kind of good in survival. And I've, I've impressed myself. I'm not going to lie. I have impressed myself. And there we go. It's actually got quite a high roof, to be honest. Uh, I didn't think the roof would be that high, but it's all good. That's fine. High roofs are good. Because that means we've got more space to fit in. Maybe like a chandelier 